Swamp milkweed is a member of the milkweed family. Its flowers are beloved by bees and butterflies alike. Like other milkweed species, it serves as a critical host for monarch butterflies. Swamp milkweed is a fantastic addition to a native garden. This low maintenance perennial is ideal for sunny borders, cottage gardens, pollinator gardens, and along the edges of ponds and streams. It is best to plant it in a permanent location because the deep tap roots should be left undisturbed once the plant is established. So let's figure out the basics on how to grow this amazing plant. Our first area we will be going over is where to plant them. Swamp milkweed, like other milkweed species, prefer an area that gets full sun, but they can also tolerate partial shade. As far as the soil goes, swamp milkweed thrives in moist, medium to wet clay soil. The plant can do well in average garden soil if it is not dry out. Wet meadows or rain gardens are an example of ideal conditions. This is because the plants thrive in a moist soil. If given a proper wetland environment, the swamp milkweed will likely not need watering throughout the growing season. If it is not an ideal environment, make sure you check daily that the soil is still moist so that the plant can thrive. Our next area will be pruning them and propagating them. Swamp milkweed does not need any pruning throughout the growing season. After the plant has died back in the winter, you can remove the dead stalk, just make sure to mark the location as swamp milkweed is slow to emerge in the spring. Now on to propagating your swamp milkweed. Swamp milkweed spreads through rhizomes. Propagating established plants in late spring can be done, but the long taproot does not like to be transplanted. For a natural spread, allow the wind-borne seeds to find their way or start it from seeds. Speaking of seeds, to grow them, collect them in fall after the brown pods have dried and started to split. Open each pod fully and let the seeds dry for one or two weeks in paper bags. Discard any seeds that show signs of damage by weevil larvae. When the seeds are dry, put them in plastic bags of perlite or vermiculite. Store for 4 to 12 weeks in a cool place that stays about 35 to 38 degrees Fahrenheit. Sow the seeds 4 to 8 weeks before the last frost in seedling trays with cells which are preferably 2 inches wide and 4 inches deep. Fill with the seedling soil mixture and moisten the soil. Press 3 seeds in each cell gently and then cover them with a layer of soil. Spray or mist them once done. Keep the seeds moist and give them light and warmth between 65 and 75 degrees Fahrenheit. Germination rates will decrease significantly at higher than 85 degrees Fahrenheit. And once you have done all this, transplant the seedlings when they have one set or more of true leaves and the danger of frost has passed. So there you have it. That's the basics of everything you need to know before you grow swamp milkweed. If you enjoyed this video and learned something new, let's get it to 15 likes and I will do a follow-up video with some more info on how to grow them, what to do over winter for them, and many other things. As always, this has been Great Grow. Feel free to subscribe and thanks for watching.